All right, now to the weather. We are keeping an eye on a system that will bring us maybe some rain, some snow, but huh, I'm just wondering, Brian, when are we going to get a warm up first? Tomorrow. Okay. There you go. Back you can talk you. about the We're snow done. now. <laughs> <laughs> okay, do we have to? No, I, I want, I, I'm ready for some snow. Uh, and then there are folks who've been waiting for this warm up we've been talking about now for a week. It'll be here for tomorrow. I've just been mesmerized by the Hone Bridge. Just the coolest thing. They did a great job. Uh, 36 degrees uh, right now, or sorry, that was the high temperature in Milwaukee. 33 was the low. When you have clouds like this, it keeps the overnight low temperatures warmer, which is about 10 degrees above normal, but you don't get a big warm up throughout the day. The difference today, we had the clouds, we had the chill, we had the wind. The wind, after being so light the last few days, picked up between 15 and 30, now between 15 and 25, and that's dropping wind chills into the low to mid-20s across southeastern Wisconsin. The lowest I see right now looks to be 21 in Waukesha. I have seen a few teens out there as well. So the weather headlines, Shannon's mild temperatures on the way for tomorrow, and oh yes, you'll need the sunglasses as well as sunshine returns. Your eyes won't be used to that. That weekend storm still has its eyes on us, and then behind the storm, the colder air moves in. It's been cloudy and dreary, but no precipitation. You get these days this time of the year that just, you get these weeks, I should say, where it just is dreary. Uh, it's just stable air mass over us. You have this blanket of clouds that we just can't burn off, but tomorrow they will move out of here and some warmer air will move in as well. You see 53 in Fargo for a high, 54 in Sioux Falls and 53 in Des Moines. We're going to get close to 50. I don't think we'll get into the lower 50s, but I, I would not be shocked tomorrow afternoon if there's a 50 on our map here in southeastern Wisconsin. 35 this evening, 34 by morning. Look at the wind. It's light, 5 to 10. And look at the temperature, 48 tomorrow afternoon with a whole lot of sunshine. Not just here in southeastern Wisconsin, but sunshine all across the Badger State and across the upper Midwest, finally getting a break from that cloudiness. More sunshine for Thursday, but notice what's coming out of the northwest by Thursday afternoon. Yep, more clouds. We get two days of sunshine and then more dreariness for the weekend. That storm system continues to track for us uh, for some rain uh, Friday afternoon, Friday night, and then it looks to be turning to snow on Saturday, maybe an inch. As of right now, it's still a couple of days away, maybe even a little bit more in some locations. We'll have to keep an eye on that over the next couple of days. But I still believe that most of this system will be rain Friday and Friday night. It would have been cold enough for snow tonight, upper 20s to lower 30s, and then let the warm-up begin mid to upper 40s tomorrow. And as I mentioned, maybe a 50 in a couple of spots. We'll call it ditto for Thursday, 47 degrees. 43 on Friday, so this will be rain late in the day as that uh, storm system moves in. Then as temperatures drop, a wintry mix on Saturday turning to snow in the afternoon. Flurries, windy and cold on Sunday, and back to normal next week with temperatures in the low to mid-30s. Uh, winter is here. Thanks, Brian.